Hi, hello dear students, welcome to our channel Maths with Panindra. In this video, I am going to discuss about straight lines for mass questions. We may expect this type of questions in the coming TS improvement or supplementary examinations. Let us have a discussion here. If 3a plus 2b plus 4c equal to 0, then show that the equation ax plus by plus c equal to 0 represents a family of concurrent lines and find the point of concurrency. Two questions are there. We have to show the given lines are representing uh, family of concurrent lines. That is one question. And second one point of concurrency that means you have to solve the two equations so let us discussion the solution first you have to write the given condition given that three a plus four b sorry not four b two b plus 4c is equal to 0, we put that equation number 1 and ax plus by plus c equal to 0, equation number 2. From equation 1, C value make subject and substitute in the equation 2. From equation 1, 4C is equal to 3A plus 2B I am taking into this side. So, minus 3A, 2B also I am taking this side, minus 2B. But I want only C, no? So, C is equal to. 4 we are taking into this side means each and every term dividing by 4. Minus 3 by 4 A minus 2 by 4 by into B. Even more simplification if you do C equal to minus 3 by 4 into A minus 2 1s or 2 2s. So, 1 by 2 into B. This is the value of C. This C value substitute in equation 2. C value substitute in equation 2. We get AX plus BY in place of C replace with minus 3 by 4 a minus 1 by 2 b is equal to 0. After that, the terms containing a, the terms containing a, the terms containing b, so these two, from these two a take common, from these two b take common. So, A into x minus 3 by 4 plus B into y minus 1 by 2 is equal to 0. It represents, otherwise simply this is in the form of, this is in the form of L1 lambda 1 plus L2 lambda 2 is equal to 0. That means lambda 1 means A, lambda 2 means B, L1 means x minus 3 by 4, L2 means y minus 1 by 2. Whenever it is representing like this, it shows that it represents family of concurrent lines. So, it represents a family of 
concurrent lines or concurrent straight lines so half of the answer over mark so first what we are doing here from the given question from the given condition first one is 3a plus 2b plus 4c equal to 0 is the condition from the condition c making subject and substituting in the equation to after that the whatever we got the result making into the form of l1 lambda 1 plus l2 lambda 2 equal to 0 it shows that family of concurrent lines after that So here I am going to put one box. From this, we need to conclude L1 is equal to x minus 3 by 4 equal to 0 and L2 equal to y minus 1 by 2 equal to 0. These are the concurrent lines these two are belongs to concurrent lines so they are asking to find point of concurrency also no? now solving these two equations solving l1 and l2 solving the above lines the simple solving dear students so x minus 3 by 4 equal to 0 means minus 3 by 4 we can take this side x is equal to 3 by 4 minus 3 by 4 i am taking into rhs so, x is equal to 3 by 4. From this equation, y minus 1 by 2 equal to 0. So, from here, y is equal to plus 1 by 2. So, x comma y are called point of concurrency only, no? Therefore, conclusion step, point of concurrency p of x comma y is equal to P of 3 by 4, comma 1 by 2. So, this is the required answer. I hope you understand the students. Thank you all of you. If you like this video really, you can share to your friends and relatives. And in the coming days, uh, I am planning to conduct the live classes also. Uh, at the time of uh, 7 to 8 